Camacho praised the policy for its focus on accountability for funding, a sore point in recent years. The days for freeness done, right? And I say that not to mean that there will not be assistance, grants, etc. But I think as a nation, this attitude we sometimes have of our hands out only to see what we could get, right? And not doing what is required to be a partner to make it happen is over. He says the faster the policy accomplishes its goals, the better for all. Let us not get hung up on the 17 to 27. If we could achieve the objectives in half the time and review and revise it, then let us do that. Let us go out there and take the bull by the horns. Let us make it work. Lewis, meanwhile, believes the policy can inspire us all to want better for sport in the country. And we now have the launch of the national sport policy in 2017. We have two approaches to it. It is either it is a false, false hope because of disappointment some of us may have gone through, or it represents the dawn of a new era and full of hope. He added that sport can no longer be seen as amateur, and the new policy points towards a professional approach for sport. It provides a framework that seeks to bring an important principle of good governance, which is predictability, transparency, and accountability. The policy covers sport from the grassroots level all the way up to the professional ranks. Kent Fuentes, TTT Sports.